What's up, YouTube? This is the Jews Wizard coming at you again with another mod review. What am I going to do today? I'm reviewing the Snowell DPV 65. Here's the box it comes in. It's got a choice of flavor black, silver, blue, and luxury gold. Obviously, I've got the luxury gold edition. It's a 65. Uh, Watt mod, you can switch it to uh, like a regular, use it like a regulated uh, mod, or you can switch it to mech mode, which is awesome. Okay, so we're off. Here's the box. Let's go ahead and unbox this. Got a nice sleeve on it. Let's set that aside for a minute. So, and then open the box. We got instruction manual. Kit contains one mod, micro USB line, a user manual, Allen key, gift box, and a certificate. And this has all the All the installation of batteries, everything needs to say warning. So here's the mod, Luxury Gold Edition. Very nice. Recess 510 threading connection, floating 510 center pen, bottom micro USB charging port. It's got a 0.66 inch OLED display battery capacity and miser resistant power voltage screen. It's got short circuit protection, low resistant warning, and overheat protection. High voltage warnings higher than 4.5 volts. Low voltage warning lower than 3 volts. It's a uh, 5 click on. That's the wattage mode. Click this three times. Click again. Wattage mode. Okay, here we got puff count. Hit it three times again. That's a 12 second relay. That means you can only take a hit for 12 seconds. It goes from 6 to 12, I do believe. Watch mode, mech mode. It's got ventilation on the bottom. We've already pre installed the two 18650 batteries. It's got ventilation for the batteries here and there and on the bottom. So it's really nice. The resistance uh, you can use on the uh, atomizer requirements is 0.2 to 4 ohms. Voltage ratings 3.7 to 4.2 ohms. So it's pretty unique. You can use it as a single or du dual 18650. It's, so that's pretty cool. It's, the button seems to squeak a little bit. It can be adjusted from 6 watts to 65 watts at 0.1 watt increments. So that's really cool. Let's get a tank on here. And see what she'll do. Okay, so I'm back. Got loaded up. My Atlantis. I got it in variable wattage mode, as you can see. Let's give her a shot. I like this vape. 
Now, like I said before, you click the button three times. Next mech mode. As you can see, once you hit the firing button, it starts climbing. It's a great mod. Like on the bomb, you don't screw these with the Allen wrench and put your batteries in. But so once you they got them in there, it's a pain in the ass to put them in. Use the USB charging port to cover it. So that's pretty good. If you press these two buttons at the same time, it locks. Key locked. Okay. So you press and hold them, and it unlocks. So that's a unique new function for this. It's high quality, high end aluminum alloy with zinc alloy material. So that's really good. Uh, air holes here, there, there to keep the batteries nice and cool. It's a really nice feature there. Make sure when you put the batteries in the first time, you face the positive and straight up on both batteries. So you don't get the uh, positive and the negative crossed over. And I'll link below and tell you where you can pick one of these up real cheap. It's a lot nicer than the DPV 50 watt. Uh, the 65 has a lot of new functions. I like the way it fits in your hand. You know... pretty decent mod for the time that I've had it so if you want to check one of these out I'll link it down below in the video I hope you like my review please subscribe comment and like below and uh, let me know how I'm doing if you have any questions feel free to ask and that's a wrap juice wizard out